per quart. Can everyone see that? Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. All right. Uh, well, thank you everyone for joining. Um, uh, the, just a reminder, these meetings are recorded. We post them on YouTube for people who are were not here um, and were not able to make it. Um, just uh, to go right into the agenda, uh, Walter had asked that we move the uh, carrier interest group face-to-face -to, -face to the beginning, um, which is fine with me. Um, so we'll go right into that. Excuse me, uh, Walter, did you want to uh, say anything in particular or um, – because I was, I was oh, going to – No, the, the first question was just uh, do we have a commitment from the chipset vendors to uh, to attend because that's quite important. As Wojtek pointed out, mm -hmm. if they're not going to attend, then there's no point in having that meeting in Silicon Valley. Uh, and, the, uh, and other than that, whatever you have planned for this uh, topic, so we've been uh, going over the um, the uh, wording of statements. We've been going over the uh, I've submitted at least for the low-level API a a draft um, agenda. Okay. Um, yeah, definitely. We we can we can talk about that uh, either here. Or we can talk about that at the low-level API meeting. Um, it's fine either way. So. No, whatever you were planning to discuss in this meeting regarding to the face-to-face -face meeting. Oh, okay. Well, I just wanted to, to confirm with folks that, the, again, the, the date and time um, is the 31st in, in, of May and uh, June 1st. And I, and I apologize, I don't have the, the confirmations in front of me. Um, and, and, uh, but I, the reason we picked that day was simply that it was the one that as many people as possible, including some of the chipset people, were uh, we're able to make it. So I will, um, I will look through my email today to, to look at the confirmations again. Um, but that generally was a, was a day that was available. Um, Could you maybe also the, the macro level, um, agenda for them those two days? Sure. Well, um, like the yeah. Sure. I mean, the, 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 the main agenda is simply that we're going to have, uh, the first, the first day is going to be focused on uh, the uh, the low level API and then the high level API, um, and then we have a couple other topics that people had wanted to talk about that are purple related or carrier interest group related. Um, I know um, Pasquale had some discussion topics he, he wanted, um, and then uh, the uh, also there was some. Uh, stuff for the uh, what I'm zoning in, trust continuum. Um, I know I know that uh, Majid wanted to talk about trust continuum. One other topic that I thought would be useful to discuss is is the topic of um, how exactly we want to move forward with SCAL. Um, I think possibly just kind of like a you know here's where we were a year ago, here's where we are now. What what do we need to do going forward? Um, kind of a chance to step back and look at look at the project. Um, but that that I'm asking the group is, is that something we want to do at this meeting? The interesting thing for the high level API might be that we're now considering uh, integrating Scala as part of the solution there. Um, so at the very least, um, if we're going to at the very least, there might be a dependency of the high level API work on Scala. Mm -hmm. And that immediate that automatically puts a, a number of requirements on scale development. Yes, that's that's very true. Um, so but I'm thinking oh. whether we are just like now trying uh, how to say that uh, in English uh, because just because we have a hammer, it's not a tool for everything, you know. So we should think about this some more. Absolutely. There, there needs Definitely. to be an assessment whether it makes sense at all, uh, for sure. Um, do we have confirmation that Felix will actually attend the face-to-face -face meeting because he's the chair of the low-level API and he's also the, the developer of Scalp? 
I, I I haven't asked him, um, but I will I will verify with him. Uh, so yeah, I, I'll talk to him today um, about that. Okay. Um, any other topic about the the face to face mini summit topic? I don't know if there, there's an interest in it, but um, and I won't be attending the meeting. But if if uh, say today had indicated that he was going to be looking at the security issue, whether or not. That should be maybe a separate topic, or at least dedicate maybe an hour as to how that project should be formed. Because we were talking about having that as a subproject. Yeah, definitely. I, uh, I'll talk about that. A, I, mean, I was going to talk about it a little later, but just the the big thing with this is the is the fact that um, the uh, I emailed the uh, lead and OpenWRT list to ask, you know, is anyone addressing the the BSI? Uh, topic already um, uh, the the report uh, I haven't got any emails back saying yes that this is being addressed um, but uh, just to just to see that you know if there's something already there there's no point in us doing it I don't think there is and I haven't seen anything so if there isn't then we can certainly uh, organize something so uh, but definitely I think that that is something we should we should talk about uh, at the at the event too And also getting a little bit back to the high-level API stuff, um, when you look at the objectives in the, in the letter of work there, the objective is primarily to create the data model. Mm -hmm. um, and then one of the things that we've been working on then is, you know, how does that fit into the architecture? But I would think that um, at the end of the day, it might be actually two separate projects, the implementation project, if we're going to be using Scala or some other type of implementation that could be um, a separate issue as mm -hmm. opposed to making sure that they, like the work that we're doing now in this phase from the high level perspective is, um, at least in terms of objectives, is making sure that we get in place the data model. But the actual implementation work, that I would think would, should be done in a separate, a separate project. Um, and we've indicated, and in the work that uh, Valfa has done has indicated one potential solution Mm -hmm. um, and you know, working together with Scott, and that should probably be something then that's discussed in the, in the Silicon Valley meeting. Uh, you know, what are the implementations that we have in front of us, uh, and work out the pros and cons between different types of things. Where I think that definitely Scott should be, you know, that's one of the different candidate uh, uh, implementations, and we and that should be discussed then. I completely agree. It would even be better if we would uh, do a little bit of a study on that to see if it makes sense and what the implications would be so that we can come to conclusions in the face-to-face -face meeting mm -hmm. rather than, yeah. uh, again, have to sit around the table going, well, I'm not sure, but... Yeah, I mean, we have to definitely do our homework before we get to the meeting, but when we get to the meeting, then, uh, you know, try to say, okay, this is the right way forward. Yeah, completely agreed. How how, do, how would you propose, uh, Walter? Do you have a, a um, you know suggestion on how we could go about doing that for the you know the the study of this? Yes, um, but maybe I'll take that offline into the conversation uh, that we're in the mail mail thread that, that we okay. have. I still have to respond to Sukhu's last uh, last mail, um, and I can bring in a few elements. But it would basically come down to take a look at OpenWRT, take a look at uh, Skull, take a look at uh, uh, RDKB, uh, and look and look to see what can be solved at what layer and whether and what fits exactly to to match which type of requirement. Mm -hmm. Okay, makes sense. Okay, we we will do that then. Um, anything else on the face to face?
All right. Uh, the uh, Scal follow-up. The only thing there is uh, I still haven't heard back from Felix on the uh, – he hasn't sent over his event proposal. Um, it's kind of on his uh, on his to-do list. So I, once I get that from him, I will pass it along to the group, and then we can, we can uh, you know, submit that for funding and hopefully get that uh, implemented. Anything else about Scal or – Okay. Uh, the um, purple feed um, for OpenWRT lead, uh, is there any update on that um, from anyone? Uh, I think it's still only the OWST that is going to be submitted to purple mm -hmm. feed, right? Yep. Okay. Yeah, we, our two resources who is working on uh, maintaining OWST is working on a, another project now. But as soon as the time is free, we are going to do some uh, code cleanup and try to get it work with Lucy and then uh, make it available. Mm -hmm. So we are hoping within this uh, within May we can achieve that. But yeah, we will give an update as soon as uh, it is closed. Okay. Sounds good. Sounds good. All right. Um, if, you know, again, a reminder: if anyone else has a uh, has um, you know a, a package they think makes sense for the purple feed, please do uh, please do consider submitting that. Um, the purple WRT security subgroup update. I kind of gave that update. Uh, I've emailed the the list to get get some some uh, feedback from the community in general. Um, I did that yesterday, so haven't gotten a lot back, but that's not surprising because it's only been a day. So um, I will then follow up with some additional people um, individually if, you know, we're not getting any responses. Um, uh, yeah, oh, I'll figure out some members of the community that I think uh, make sense. Um, that's, that's it for that. Um, for... Um, Board farm. Uh, is there anything from Altron in that? Um? Well, well, yes. <coughs> Sorry, I'm a bit today. That's okay. Um, so, Eric, uh, basically, as I have mentioned before, we have been um, um, uh, preparing some things. Uh, we don't have code right now. We are right now preparing a document. Uh, which I would like to present maybe in the following week. I'm still not sure about this date, but this is our goal, mm -hmm. uh, where we start to discuss, to, to bring some topics uh, to be discussed, like um, which areas are we going to, to cover with the board farm or, or the solution that we are going to use for the acceptance tests. Mm -hmm. We are also proposing uh, some structure to organize this. For example, uh, we're going to test services, uh, interfaces, the system itself, some APIs, mm -hmm. and still within the scope, uh, the test types that we want to, to include, if it's functional, performance, uh, security, so on. Also some um, properties and design um, heuristics for the test structure because uh, we think that the number of test cases can increase uh, very fast and we want to make this in a, um, a structured way so it's easy to load new models or unload some. Um, and some dependencies about the architecture solution. So basically these are, and, and, and also the, how we plan to, uh, to collect and store the, the outputs. I mean, are we going to just register if a test case has passed or failed? Are we going to also store more data like observed results such as um, the, the throughput of a specific test case, the CPU usage, the memory usage, and so on. So, as a brief, we are preparing a document uh, with these topics that we want to bring to the table to also start discussing with the community. I don't know if you have any comments. No, I, I, I personally don't, but uh, does anyone else have any comments? All 
All right. Well, I mean, I think it's I think it sounds great. I, I look forward to kind of a you know kind of a presentation to go through what what your thoughts are and, uh, and understanding better uh, how you, how you think we should move forward on this. Um, definitely, uh, definitely uh, sounds interesting to me. Please, oh, uh, please do keep me up to date on on when you when you'd like to do that uh, presentation. Um, yeah, yeah, sure. I, I, will, I will let you know. Okay, awesome. Thank you. All right, um, the uh, uh, Open WRT Summit. Um, I don't think there's really any update this week that much. Uh, uh, there was some additional information about tables and sponsorship for. Um, uh, the summit, but that's not not really all that interesting. Um, it, kind of just moving forward with the uh, prospectus for the sponsors, um, and we're going to we'll uh, we'll do that. Um, not a whole lot there though. Everything's everything's moving forward um, at a you know decent clip, and I think that's good. A bit of a comment. I just yep. noticed that uh, Broadband World Forum in Berlin has been scheduled straight on top of uh, ELCE and uh, OpenWRT Summit. Yes. Which is going to be painful maybe for some of us. Yes, that that was, um, we, we I think uh, Bruce had brought that up. Um, I think maybe uh, two, it was uh, maybe a month ago or so, and we had a, we had a a vote on which days would be would be preferable, and it seemed like people preferred the day of those last two days, that that Thursday and Friday, despite the fact of Broadband World Forum. Um, so that's why we went with that. Okay, that's good. That should be compatible. I, I simply wasn't aware of the day of Broadband World Forum until this week. Yeah, it, it's unfortunate, but I mean, in, in some fairness, no matter what day we pick, there's going to be some some issues, no matter what. So, I mean, there's always another event. But yeah, it, it's not ideal by any means. I would agree there. All right. Um, any other comments or questions about OpenWRT Summit or anything else? Yeah, I'd like to return back to the mini summit um, yeah. just really quickly. Mm -hmm. um, do you have the possibility of putting together, like, you know, maybe an hour by hour, um, uh, what do we call it, uh, schedule for, okay. that, for those two days? Because I think that would also help people in prioritizing their time. Definitely. No, we can do that. I, I, um, I, the plan is that. I was going to leave the scheduling somewhat up to the uh, to the committees, the subcommittees. Um, so. Well, I think yeah, but what my suggestion would be is that you just do it at subcommittee level. So yeah, like, okay, no, definitely. So that this, this block this block of time is allocated to the subcommittee. Okay. Oh, okay. I see what you're saying. Yeah. Um, I can do that definitely. Uh, yeah, we can do that. I will. Uh, I'll get. I'll go ahead and do that and uh, confirm with the subcommittees that it works. Um, Sounds good. Thanks. All right. Any other comments or questions? All right. Well, um, I will. Uh, I I apologize that I did not have more to report this week. Unfortunately, I was well. Fortunately. Uh, for me, but unfortunately for progress, I was off on Monday and Tuesday, so have not got done as much as I'd like to this week. Um, so, well, thank you everyone uh, for joining, and we will uh, talk again um, next week. Thank you. Bye-bye. Thanks. Bye. Thank you, Eric. See you. Bye.